1955 Chevrolet. It took me two years to restore. Me being retired, spent six to eight hours a day down in my friend's shop doing it. We had, had shipped it to Fort Worth, had it acid bath off the frame, had the frame sandblasted and powder coated. Rear ends from a 99 Camaro, Camaro with the Track and disc brakes. Disc brakes all the way around. Engines are brand new 350. 700 R4 transmission with a stick in the void. And it's magnificent. Look, check out the inside, guys. Look at this. He did a really great job. And it's totally worth it. Man, someday I, I want to do something like this because this is awesome. You better have a whole bunch of money. And also help from my friend Roma who works on ca on cars and stuff anyway because I don't know Jack Diddley squat about cars. Well, I didn't, I didn't, I had my doubts when I started this because I had never really taken a car apart before. I haven't either. But I had the man I bought it from. <clears throat> had body shop and I cussed her five years ago some boys brought her in and wanted to make a hot rod out of it it was red and white and rusty I think, I think the blue is a better color for this it seems to fit this car a lot better than red it had two inches of red shit in the floors all the seats were gone rusted out well. most of the dash up there was missing. Well, it seems like you did a very good job. Thank you. Now, I'll let you go. I just wanted to show you guys that I just wanted to show you guys the guy that owns this car and how well he restored it. That's what it looked like. Oh, here's what it looked like before. I still think blue's better color than that for this. Holy cow engine compartment on it. Back when it back before you restored it. Yeah, when I started on it. That's, that's, the bodies have been going off forget the acid bath. Mm -hmm. That's the frame when it came back from being powder coated sandblasted. Bath. Sure is neat looking. See all the all the holes. See all the holes that didn't have, didn't have any of the chrome on the sides or anything. It just had the holes. Well, you've certainly found good chrome to go on it. We had to replace the floor, but before we did, we welded in a cage to keep the car from jackknifing, folding in two. Oh. We had to put the you know, whole new floor in. There's, there's the new floor. Yeah. And there's the new floor now. <laughs> mm -hmm. It's beginning to go back together. Completely rewired the whole car. All the wiring out that was in it. This is the man that owned the shop. He came over and did a did a few little things that were tricky that I wasn't sure what I was doing. That would be what it'd be like with me and Roma if we did something like this. He'd be doing the the most of the restoring, and I'd just be watching. She's very pretty. We've been married for just a little over 50 years now. We knew each other for two weeks before we got married. Sounds like my parents. They got they didn't they never dated, they just got married. <laughs> and there's the finished product. 
thank you for sharing your time with us and tell and let and letting us get a peek at your car. It's it certainly was a, a blast from the past to look at. I've got, got about a dozen trophies in my car. Well, they're certainly well earned. You did a bang up job. <laughs> thank you.